All right. Uh, welcome again. Will Rogers with me. Will Rogers is a junior at uh, Mountain View High School. Sevy, I appreciate you joining me. Um, just wanted to pick your brain real quick. Obviously, this is kind of a crazy time and um, unprecedented in our country, and we're all trying to figure out um, what do we do with our time. And obviously, you have way more time than you've ever had before because you're not in school. Um, and so talk to me a little bit about your routines. What are you doing to build routines, and what do those look like for you? Uh, yeah, so – Pretty much once this COVID thing happened, I realized like the first day that I had way more free time than I thought I might, um, which was pretty good the first day. And then the second day I started getting very bored. So I realized that this day could be much more productive. So what I started doing was um, writing in my journal stuff that I could be doing. And I have to go through that checklist every morning. Um, I have to get that stuff done before I can do um, other stuff, video games, go on my phone, stuff like that. So pretty much just writing my journal every morning uh, has helped me a lot, be much more productive with my day and feel better about myself. Walk to me, uh, walk us through some of the things, like what does a, a day in the life of Will Rogers look like? Obviously with school, it takes up a huge point, but now with COVID going on, what does it look like? What time are you up? What time are you to bed? What happens in between there? Yeah, so wake up in the morning. Um, I'll do my first class right away. It takes about, 30 minutes I'd say then I eat a big breakfast um, then I go through the rest of my classes eat lunch after that uh, then I come up to the gym I get my lift in do some hitting or catching throwing program uh, maybe some speed work and then after that is done I have to do reading um, for a little while ACT prep and then some vision therapy before I can do my video game stuff usually do that for a little bit eat some dinner um, and then go to bed at around 11 o'clock, try to wake up at about 8. What time are you getting done with your schoolwork every day? Uh, at about 1.30. Okay, so then headed up to the weight room or to the facility at what time? Uh, we usually head up there after lunch, so probably 2.30, um, give some good time to eat lunch, and then just chill for a little bit after school, um, come up to the weight room, and then usually here for about, Depends on the day. Like today, we're here for about an hour, so not too much. Just got some light hitting, light lift, but usually three hours, two and a half, something like that. Okay. How many days, Will, are you just shutting it down in general? Like where you're just couch, vegging out, Netflix for five, six hours? Um, I don't know the last time that I've done that. So I actually, I, don't, I never do that. But Sundays, we usually just do um, catching work. Um, we, we try to take off hitting and lifting Sundays, but we still do something. Um, cause I just, I, I don't think I, I'd be able to just do that for a full day, but yeah. What's been the biggest challenge for you in, in the middle of this kind of pandemic that's going on? What's been the biggest challenge for you as a 17 year old? Uh, as a 17 year old, I think just being able to hang out with my friends is probably the biggest one. I think a lot of people can relate to that one. Um, I've really liked, honestly, having the online classes because you can work at your own pace. But the biggest thing I actually do miss school is just being able to see my friends. Um, so that's that's pretty much been the biggest thing, one of the only things. Awesome. Well, Sevi, I know you got to get to mental conditioning, so I'll get out of your hair. But I appreciate you giving us a couple minutes and hopefully this gives some insight into kind of how different athletes are dealing with this and, and building a routine. So I appreciate it, man. I'll get out of your hair. and Thanks again for the time, buddy. Yep, sounds good. Thank you, Coach. Everybody.